obviously the, the stock market has rallied significantly since President Trump took office and actually since the election and, and then again since he took office. Do you view that as a report card Absolutely. for the administration? Absolutely. I mean, th this is a mark-to-market -market business and you see what the market thinks. If the market were to pull back, is that just disappointment and things not getting done as quickly as market had anticipated? Or do you just expect, you've watched the markets for a long time, do you expect to pull back at some point when you see things move so far so quickly? Well, look, I, you know, I've always been focused in the markets on not day trading and where they are day to day. So whether the market goes up or down on any given day, you know, I've, I've given up figuring out <laughs> why, why that is. Smart man. So, you know, but do I think that, you know, over the course of the year, uh, we're in an environment where there's very attractive investment opportunities in the U.S. And uh, I, th I think that's reflective of, of the administration's goals and what the market thinks of it. You, you have said that you expect interest rates to remain relatively low for some period of time. Um, but when we get to this growth that you're expecting of 3% or better, how quickly do you think um, interest rates will have to adjust to catch up with that, to reflect a strong economy? Uh, well, let me say this is really more the Fed's role and not my role. And uh, I do look forward. I'm starting my weekly meetings with with Janet Yellen at the Fed, and I look forward to spending time with her. Um, you know, I would just comment again: we're in an environment where we are at historically low interest rates, mm -hmm. and I, I think if you look at this on a historical basis, we will probably have low interest rates for a long period of time. But that doesn't mean that they're within that. There's not the context that interest rates can go up. And you've seen the Fed signal that. Mm -hmm. So again, I'm not going to speculate on what they're going to do. But m my comments are really about where we are, not relative to just today, but where we are relative to where interest rates have been over a long period of time. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.